In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Razer Huntsman Mini to Xbox. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can easily set up and use your Razer Huntsman Mini on any Xbox console, either old gen Xbox One or newer gen Xbox Series S or X. You will be able to plug it into any of the available ports and use the keyboard for basic input. So all that you have to do is unbox your Razer Huntsman Mini and to start plug a USB cable into it. Now you just have to plug the other end of the cable into the Xbox console. So you can either use a USB-C going into the keyboard to USB-A which goes into the console or USB-C to USB-C if you have one of those plugs available in your Xbox console. As soon as you plug one end of the cable that you are using into the keyboard and another one into the Xbox console, you will be able to use it natively. So the Xbox, if it is powered on, will automatically detect the keyboard and will set it up for you. Like I said, it will be used for basic input, so you will be able to issue commands if you are playing a game that has native support for keyboards, and you will be able to type in text chat, web browser, and so on. However, you will not be able to customize the keyboard in the same depth as you would on a PC. Because the keyboard is designed to be used on PCs primarily, even though you can still use it for basic input, you will not be able to change stuff like the RGB, setup, macros, and so on. You can only do this by using the Razer Synapse software, which is exclusive for PC. But on Xbox, you will be able to connect it to a USB-C cable going into the keyboard and then into the console, and once it is detected, you will be able to use it for basic input inside of games that have support and for text chat. Keep in mind that if you are trying to play a game that does not have native support for keyboards, you will not be able to use it. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Razer Huntsman Mini to Xbox. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!